So, I found this site, and the geek in me went nuts. Stay with me on this one. The kids loved it, so find a way to use it. With the Hero Factory, students can design their own superheroes. I decided to use it as an end-of-the-year extra credit project for science. The students were tasked with organizing the Atomic Spitballs, the world's newest super team. Each of the seven members represented a science unit from the year. For example, one student needed to have powers related to mixtures and solutions, or other science units from the year. The final project was completed in Wix. They had to include hero names, the costumes, and an explanation of the science behind the heroes. This is actually uh, an example from class. I'll be honest, since I didn't make this a class assignment and supervise a bit more, many creations were off the mark. Next year I'm going to use this idea earlier in the year and I'll be more deliberate in my expectations. First thing, the students will complete the biographies including science explanations before they even see the Hero Factory. I'll have them create, submit, and edit a Google Doc before tackling the costumes. In this exercise, in a way, and I might be reaching, the students are explaining and illustrating the concepts. I think the Hero Factory works great with science, and it will take some creative thinking to make it work with other subjects, but let me offer a couple of ideas. Could the students use it to review and internalize historical figures? No, I didn't write... Uh, explanations, but uh, that's certainly something the kids uh, would be expected to do. Could they imagine punctuation as heroes? And their powers and their, their background stories would, would have something to do with those punctuation marks, something that will help them to remember what those are used for and uh, what they emphasize. Let me point out an issue that you will have. The finish button doesn't work. Uh, I, I've tried three different browsers and I just could not get it to work. So I taught my students to use the snipping tool to take screen photos. On a Mac, you'll need to use the Shift Command 4 to take screen photos. I assure you, the students were thoroughly excited about this tool. Even when ideas weren't easily popping into their minds, they persevered and worked together to design their heroes. Using technology and cool applications will do that. Kids aren't quick to give up. For that reason, you have to find something to use in your classroom. I hope you'll use the Hero Factory. Have fun.